from their scathing war of words to well-wishing and good sportsmanship, it looks like Nick Kyrgios and Bernard Tomic have finally settled their beef. When you think of tennis, country clubs and good sportsmanship might come to mind. Not beefs like the kind we see in hip-hop, but that's exactly what's been going on between these two Australian players who were once friends and allies on the tour. Kyrgios and Tomic have been in a bitter back and forth for years, while one of their stars rises and the other seems to fall. And for a long time, it seemed like they might be in each other's bad books forever. But how did the two know each other, and how did their beef get started? Kyrgios and Tomic have both seen some pretty dizzying heights in the world of tennis, and it's because of the sport that the two have met and clashed. Kyrgios is currently ranked number 26 in the world in the ATP singles rankings. He began playing tennis as an early teen, winning his first junior title at the age of 15. In 2012, he turned pro, and the young player quickly rose through the rankings, reaching a career high of number 13 in the world back in 2016. He's won seven ATP Tour singles titles throughout his career, including two Washington Opens, and he's reached 11 finals, most notably a major final at the 2022 Wimbledon Championships. In doubles, he's ranked as high as number 11 in the world during his professional career, and he's only the third player ever to have beaten each one of the big three, Roger Federer, Rafael Nadal, and Novak Djokovic the first time he played against them. His aggressive style of play has been branded highly entertaining, but it seems like the 28-year-old is also a bit temperamental, being notorious for throwing epic tantrums and rants on the court. In fact, according to Tennis Head magazine, Kyrgios has received more fines for his on-court behavior than any other player in ATP history. Maybe his hot temper has played a part in his beef with Tomic. And that brings us round to Bernard. Bernard Tomic is now ranked 432nd in the world. Though at one point in his career, the professional tennis player held the ATP singles ranking of 17 back in the year 2016. Tomic began playing tennis at a very young age, and as an early teen, he won too many junior titles to count, including an Orange Bowls title and two junior Grand Slam singles titles. In 2008, aged only 15 years old, he began competing in professional events and Tomic went on to win four titles so far in his career, including two Claro Open Columbias. Throughout his career, Bernard has been criticized for his controversial behavior, including accusations of tanking during events and altercations with both officials and fans. The former top-ranked player has had his career take a nasty turn over the past few years, as he missed appearances and failed to qualify for the more prestigious tennis tours. But how are he and Kyrgios acquainted, and what seems to have triggered their bizarre back and forth over the years? Well, Tomic and Kyrgios both hail from Australia, and as compatriot competitors, they spent a lot of time together on the tours growing up. Kyrgios has spoken on their relationship, saying, We were pretty good mates when I was younger, and also noting how, as competitors from the same country, the older Tomic had helped guide him when he was new to many of the tournaments they attended together. It seems like the animosity between the two began back in 2017 after Bernard appeared to be unraveling mentally, saying that he was bored of tennis and bragging about how much money he was making despite showing less and less commitment to the sport. When his former friend showed signs of mental instability, Kyrgios commented in a blog post on Player's Voice describing how he no longer understood his former friend, finding his contradicting words and actions confusing. Nick also mentioned how he believed he was now in a different league to his former competitor, and it seems that time has proven him right, as Kyrgios has maintained a high ranking in the ATP singles, has fallen far from the 17 spot he used to hold. Since then, the two have spoken about each other in many interviews and had numerous exchanges online, airing out their grievances publicly for the world to watch. It's pretty sad considering the two were once friends. Even the smallest instigation has been enough to fan the fires of their feud. For instance, in 2021 when a fan on social media told Kyrgios that his rival was better than him, Nick wasted no time responding with some scathing words for his former pal, saying, Better in what way? I've got a higher career high, more money, more wins, and give back whenever I can. He went on to claim that Tomic was essentially done in the sport 
while he himself has years left to play. When Tomek caught wind of Kyrgios' comments, he responded in turn, saying that the reason his name bothers Nick so much is that he idolized Bernard growing up and fears that he'll live in his shadow his whole career. Tomek cited the records he set as a teenager, saying that Nick is bothered that he can't rewrite history and knows that Bernard's style is superior to his and that he's beat him. Here, Tomek was referring to the only match the two rivals have ever partaken in, which Bernard did in fact win. It seems that the two have had no problem airing out each other's dirty laundry online either, as Kyrgios' response got pretty personal. Nick posted to his Instagram story implying that his rival was broke by claiming that he had paid for Tomek's flights home on one occasion. He also branded Bernard the most hated athlete in Australia. A brutal insult that was sure to get right under his former friend's skin. If that wasn't bad enough, he screenshotted Tomek's rankings at the time, claiming that he didn't know how bad it had gotten and that he'd be happy to coach his old friend on how to play tennis. I mean, when they say words can sting, they're definitely talking about words like those. In 2022, things got so heated between the pair that Tomek challenged his old friend to a boxing match. When speaking to the press, Tomek addressed his old rival, saying that they should settle their feud once and for all. He mentioned how he had already beaten Kyrgios once and then suggested a tennis match where each would put up one million and the winner takes all. Then, he seemingly went off the rails, saying that he'd beat his rival at basketball and even telling him to step into the ring and put his gloves on. After this bizarre callout, Kyrgios responded in an interview with the Courier Mail saying, He's not very good anymore, he's not relevant anymore, and he's obviously got money issues. Kyrgios went on to claim that he and his family have helped Tomek out financially before and that he finds it very disrespectful that his former friend would challenge him to a fight. Nick also said that his rival didn't even have a million to put up, as he's dead broke, but finished off by saying that maybe in the future they would face each other on the court, and he believes he'd win. Since then, the two have poked fun at each other on social media, but recently it seems like the pair may have buried the hatchet. At the start of 2023, Tomek wished Kyrgios a speedy recovery after finding out that his rival was hospitalized with a knee injury. In April of 2023, during a Q&A session on Instagram, a fan asked Nick if he is still beefing with his former friend, to which he responded, Absolutely not. I'm doing me. I wish him all the best and hope he wins some more futures. With that, it seems like the two rivals may have finally buried the hatchet for good. But who knows? Their feud has died down several times over the years, only to be reignited by a slight comment from one or the other. So there you have it, tennis fans. From their scathing war of words to well-wishing a good sportsmanship, it looks like Nick Kyrgios and Bernard Tomic have finally settled their beef.